The HTML editor integrates with all learning environment tools that have HTML content creation capabilities. For example, the HTML editor is available when you edit discussion topics, create custom instructions for Dropbox folders, and create content topics. But there's even much more than that. So this tutorial is going to show you how to insert a table into the HTML editor. You should note that this tutorial is going to show you creating a table within a module. A table can be added to any content that has the HTML, HTML editor available, such as the Dropbox directions or feedback, quiz questions, quiz feedback, etc. Anywhere the HTML editor is available, you can insert a table. To do this, you click on the Insert Table icon. Dialog, dialog box will appear. Choose how many columns and rows you need for the table. Note, you can always add more columns and rows at a later time. Type in an initial width you think that you need, you need for the table row. Note, you can adjust this at a later time. Click the insert. And then what you want to do is enter the text for each of the table cells. As you type, you'll notice that the width of the table cells will adjust automatically. When I click in another cell and start typing in that other cell, it will adjust automatically also. It's a little difficult to find the cell, but you just got to kind of get to it. And when you're done, just click off of the table. 